Welcome back everybody to another toy review and today we have the brand new drop from Spaced Out Design. Well known for their awesome looking Geodraxis figures. I've been super excited to actually do a review for them since I haven't yet. Their drops are a little bit smaller. They only ever have three or four figures per drop but there are some really cool exciting ones in here so let's go check them out and if you like the figures you see in this video make sure to go support them as well go check out their website grab what figures are left all right let's see what we got in this package let's get the receipt out of here ah yes oh yes i forgot sometimes i give you some really cool geodraxa stickers i love these things i forgot they handed these out gotta love the freebies all right let's start yeah this is a good place to start right here perfect let's do the green figures here is the base model paint for this green this shiny little green one i'll put up the names of the figures too because i can i can never remember what they're actually called for these guys but let's pull this guy out again just the base and let's see how he looks i mean he looks freaking sweet in my opinion check that out such a nice glossy kind of toothpastey metallic -y toothpaste glean on it which is really sharp I am definitely going to put my own little custom highlights on this piece. I don't know what yet, but uh, I'm definitely going to do something with it because it's just really dope. All the Geodraxes come with an extra little head piece or whatever piece you want to call it and a sword, which I usually attach to my the arms of my Geodraxes because they just look BA like that. But let's see how they did their paint job on this nice green figure. So let's get this one out now. Bang, look at that beauty. They got a nice sharp looking highlighted yellow on him on parts of the hands, the back, even that back looks really sweet and the face and obviously the chest piece and everything. Really sharp, really, really just simple and sweet figure from Geodraxis, but they always look just super clean and super sharp. I mean, as you can tell, this guy looks really, really good. Let's flip around the head. I've actually never really thought about putting that piece as the head before, which is kind of funny, but there you go. Check it out, man. I'm a fan of the green color palette, so you know I had to get me one of these and then just getting that, that base one was just an absolute must for me. And I believe these were the cheapest figures on the site too. They have a couple others that were a little bit more expensive, but for these, these were like the nice base ones for the set. And I believe these are still available on the store as well. Very sharp, very cool. Let's get the next one out here and let's do the nice translucent red figure now this one looks super awesome they even got a custom well let's just let's just get them out of the bag here bada bing bada boom look at that clean one right there super 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 nice translucent really unique red honestly it's such a nice looking red it's not what i originally thought it's kind of got this like orange tinge to it i guess you could say but it's got this really custom work here that has like teeth on that little chest piece and as you can see, that thing just looks beautiful in the light. Holy crap. Take a look at that. Sharp, sharp, nice silver medals on the head, on the back as well. A really cool looking figure. This one, I know for a fact, uh, as of filming this video, it is sold out, unfortunately. So you might have to pick this one up on eBay or maybe they'll do a restock, but my ch chances are probably not. So you might've missed out on this one unless you pick it up from another seller or whatnot, but this one's really, really sweet. And I kind of want to throw on his arm for this guy even. Let's check out the other two pieces. So we've got a bada bing, a bada boom, the nice little arm piece and the extra head, which it's actually got like a, kind of like a grill pattern going on in there, which actually is really dope looking. I quite like that. Maybe I'll actually put on the other head for this one. But there he is with the sword arm, as you can see. I mean, look, it. come on, that looks freaking awesome. I love the sword hands. They look really, really sweet. And just, man, such a nice figure. I did end up, uh, let's see if I can get the other one out here. I did end up getting two of this guy. I'm going to keep this one sealed. Uh, I might do a custom work on this just because I love the translucent, but I mean, come on, right? That just looks phenomenal. This is going to be a shorter video. We've only got one figure left. As I said before, they only had four figures total in this drop, but this one is an absolute banger. I couldn't believe it when I saw it. It looks amazing just from the pictures and everything they were hyping up before the drop actually happened. So I picked up two of these as well because they just look super, super dope. All right, let's pull them out and let's check them out. Look at these mother frickers. Oh my gosh, I got them both backwards. I am going to keep one sealed since I got two of them, but 
we are gonna pop one of these open right now because it just looks incredible. Now, I'm not entirely sure the process of how they make these, but I know it's a special way to paint the PVC plastic resin molding or whatever have you. I don't know all the details. I'll try to put some information up on screen for you guys. Uh, but it reminds me a lot of like the nice stuff customs that a lot of the Glios people had back in the day. It's just got this nice, like beautiful looking, oh, he is stuck together a little bit just from sitting in the packaging. Beautiful looking gradient going on with the translucency. As you can see, it goes from that blue to like that green to that yellow. And oh my gosh, got that silver highlighting similar to the red, but just phenomenal looking piece. Come on, that is stunning. And it's got sparkles, sparkles too, which sparkles, you, you don't see a lot of the sparkles anymore in the Glios figures. Uh, I know it's kind of like a harder casting and harder process to make guys like this. So that's probably why, but I wish they would do it more because holy crap, that looks super sweet. Uh, since I got into Glios later in the game, I've picked up a couple ones that have kind of like that glitter effect to them, but not a lot because again, they kind of stopped doing them that way. So this was like a throwback Glios piece for Spaced Out. That's what I understand from the process, but I, I love figures like this. I love the translucent ones in this glad glitter and then extra transitional effect of colors running throughout the piece just is super phenomenal. And here are the two extra pieces. Again, like the red's got that graded little effect here with the silver and a nice blue translucent head. And then we also have the sword, the yellow sword glitter in all its glory looking sick. So as of filming this video, they do still have these guys in the store. So Get them while they're there, guys. I don't know how many they made of these, but these two are just incredible. I think they look incredibly sharp. I mean, come on, right? This is super, super sick. A really clean, nice, elegant drop from Space Down Designed. I love the Geodraxis dudes. I'm slowly building up the collection of them. I've missed a lot of their really, really dope older sets of drops where they had some really, really banger translucent figures that I'm trying to catch myself up on and buy from aftermarkets and stuff like that. But so getting a drop that had like some two really cool banger translucent figures is just super exciting, super fun. I can't get over this guy. He just looks super, super cool, man. They do a great job. They have such professionalism at Spaced Out Design. They give you the little freebies with the stickers and they make a really solid, clean product. As you can see, hopefully from the video, hopefully I'm doing a good job representing kind of how just nice and solid. They're always clean figures. Nothing ever, you know, going wrong with them. They have just a nice, good look to them. You can tell they really put a lot of hard work into producing these, which is why I think they usually have the limited number of figures to their drops, just because I think it helps them focus in on how to make the best product possible for the Glios. There's one last closer look of all the figures from the drop. I think this is phenomenal. I'm loving this guy, just they did such a great job with him. Here is the website right up here. Go check them out, see what's left in the store. Go support these guys. They definitely deserve it. They do a phenomenal job with all the figures and just another fantastic drop from them. Spaced Out Design, hats off to you. I'm already enjoying the crap out of these Glios. What else can I say about them that I already haven't said three times in this short little video? So I'm just gonna kind of cut it there and let you guys as Glios fans or people just discovering Glios, go check them out and see what you think about the products yourselves and go support the creators of this. But thank you for watching all the way to the end of the video. If you guys enjoy the toy reviews for Glios and openings for Crazy Bones and all our TCG stuff that we do on the channel as well from Force of Will to Pokemon, then you're going to want to stay tuned. I would ask you to subscribe and leave a like on the video and share it around. It helps support the channel and you'll be notified every time a new video comes out, which is usually on Wednesdays and Sundays. Enjoy the rest of the video lineup this week and we will catch you guys in the next one.